Believe it or not, uh, as modern as our hospitals are today, we still find patients dead in bed. And that should never happen, except in a palliative care unit where you expect it to happen. But uh, we should always get early warning that they're getting into trouble. We have the technology now to monitor patients wirelessly, uh, with very small monitors that can tell us if somebody's getting into trouble. With anesthesia, the, probably the biggest preventable problem was opioid-induced respiratory depression. I think more and more hospitals are moving to technology to assist the nurse because the nurse is human and, uh, you know, and she can't be everywhere at once. And uh, we need the patients monitored continually, particularly if they're on opioids because there's such a variation in the way they respond to them. And we know the opioids, though they're great drugs, they'll get rid of your pain, they can kill you. The parameters you can do, which uh, we've got on uh, Patient Safety Movement Foundation website, app number four, it'll give you the formula, the recipe, to uh, be able to put in place in your hospital. It's well accepted, it's standardized, but again, you know, people are in a hurry, people don't stop and do what they should do. And uh, that's why the patient needs to be empowered in this and feel very comfortable asking the question.